Sounds like they found the bodies you sliced off. Military's going to be on our ass. <laughs> Shit! behind you. Keep up and stay close. 
Vamos, ¿ok? ¡Ok! Be nice, horse. Let's ride. lost them. See, si, we're good. You ride well. You're not bad yourself. Where did you learn to shoot like that? Military Academy. 16 to 21. Mm, we can use that. I also make a mean mojito. <laughs> Believe that when I taste it. Haven't had anything but Philly septic tank shit for weeks. I'm going to pretend that's not a thing. Seems like Castillo's made things pretty rough out here. His nephew Jose is the real problem for us. We call that tiny bastard Napoleon the Pequeño. Little Napoleon? Cute. The name is cuter than the man. The Monteros have been on this land for 200 years, and now he's turned it all into slave camps for that Vivido bullshit. Jose works our people non-stop with a gun to the head. Come mierda even took my papa. He was in those fields too long. Poison made him sick. Not that he'd ever admit it. Now papa leads a little revolution of his own. You're going to need Libertad if you want to stop Castillo. You're not the first one to tell me that. But Papa's got a bit of pride in him. Only trusts his own blood. You're a Montero or you're a nobody. So what you're saying is, I'm fucked. <laughs> I, I don't know. There's something different about you. You're not like the others Clara said. Maybe he'll like you. Maybe. How far away is this camp of yours? Not far. You in a rush? No, no. It's okay. Getting some good cardio in. Now, guerrera. The sword and the hero. Nice to see you two alive. But I will find it, Hera. Oh. It was all trouble, but lucky for you, this one's good. <laughs> well, you're just in time. El Jefe is making dinner. Thing? Bullshit. Who's that? My name is... I'm not asking you. Easy, Papa. This is Danny from Libertad. Libertad don't mean shit to me. And where's our blindfold? Papa, look around. These are farmers, no fighters. You want Chorizo to go out and blow up Napoleon and Pequeño? Hey, 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 hey. Leave Chorizo out of this. Our people need to learn to be a guerrilla, Camila. From us. That's why I'm here. Don't look like no guerrilla to me. All I see is a tourist. The tourist fucks us. It's on you, Camila. He likes you. Welcome to Finca Montero, hero. Come on, Choris. Save it for dessert, buddy. Come on.
Oye, guerrilla. Clara, I made contact with the Monteros. How did it go? Well, Carlos wants nothing to do with me, but I get along with his daughter. I think she's my way in. You need to understand them. Because I'm one of them. First step is understanding this camp. I'm going to have a look around. How do we win? Okay, Danny. Take care of yourself. Hey, look, it's Danny. I have to be honest, I don't speak bark, amigo. Well, you're always hungry, aren't you? Maybe you'll like me if I bring you something tasty, hmm? Oye, Dani. Lost tourist. Listen, Carlos. I know you don't trust me or Clara or Libertad. Or all the other little come mierda she sent. And I don't blame you. We got no history here. You got that right. What else you know? I know that Napoleon El Pequeño stole your land. I know that the poison he sprays on your fields is killing your people. I know that you're sick. And you would rather die than ask for help. Don't throw anything away that you can use. The depot where they store the poison? Burn it to the ground. The dusters. Let's spray the tobacco. Rip them apart. The fumigators in the fields. Kill them all. You got it, Jefe. Send me a postcard. Some Come, here. Come here. Come here. Okay, mijita, here's the deal. I'm the cockfight champion around here, okay? Me and Gordito, we were gonna retire undefeated. Except this one hijo de puta, Ramon. He came up in here and rigged our final match with his juice stop bird, Singao. I had to give him Gordito's special spurs when he won. And now my little compai is traumatized. He don't eat right. Feathers got no gloss. Won't even let me do his nail treatments. You gotta get those spurs back for him, okay? 
Please, mommy. Please. Yes! Mommy, you badass! Come find me when you got those spurs. So, you want to join the fan? Think your bird is a champion? We will find... Today's challenger, weighing in at a whopping 47 grams, is a truly fierce and feisty power. Let's your best! Don't worry, my bird will make this quick. Round one, fight! Take your hand, but I'm too pissed off. Round two, fight! You got lucky. Haha, <laughs> San Canela! Come watch the fight! New challengers! Old champions!
Hola, Doc.
Lara, I'm near some sort of metal factory. Shit, stay sharp. I heard some strange rumors about that place, but if you're going in, look for any convoy trucks filled with metal. If you take one, we can use the scrap it was hauling. Got it. Whoa now! Easy. Qué coño. Hey Elvis, I found Ramon's hideout. And I found Ramon too. Ah, see? Sí. That como mierda got my boy Spurs? No. I think he's dead. Well, shit. Gosano got what he deserved then. But you still gotta find those Spurs. Gordito's little feet look so naked. Uh, right. Elvis, what the fuck is this place? It's like I took an express elevator to hell. I told you, that rat fuck son of a bitch Ramon is sick in the head. It fuck his abuelo over a goddamn percentage. You surprised? I have to get out of here. If roosters start coming out of the walls, it's game over, man. Just don't leave without Gordito's spurs. Oh shit, that's one fucked up bird. For you, gordito. Okay, can't wait to get out of here. Worsters. Coño, I'm fucking gallos. Place smells like shit. Get me out of here. It's Danny. That that place? Blood. Shit. Birds everywhere. I barely made it out alive. Okay, come on, come on, come on. But like, you got the spurs though, no? Yeah, I got them. 
And I'm fine, thanks. Gordito, you hear that? Yes, Danny. Papi's wiggling his little butt with happiness. Now come back here. Is this Yami? Found your number on a poster about racing. Oh, if you like racing, you call the right number. We do it guerrilla style. Each track is marked with checkpoint flares you gotta drive through. Try to beat the best time. You in? Fuck it. Yeah. I'll try it. That's the racing spirit right there. I like you already. Suerte! Oye, guerrilla. Anyone can shoot a gun. Build a camp. Now that takes skill. You never seen that. Looks like some cop. Look, the guerrilla's back. Man, I'm. Can I be real with you for a second? You did something really special right here. I'm gonna tell you a secret, okay? I throw most of my fights. I just can't stand the idea of Gordito getting hurt. Burns me up. These spurs, they make him happy. And that's all that matters. Now, <clears throat> you did us a favor, and I trust you. But if you say anything to anyone, I'll fuck you up. I got a rep to protect, okay? Not that some guy is crops. Someone should put him down. Come, buy some shit. Still. I'm Lola, aka Goddess of Goods and Ghosts. I'm. I need your help to find the lieutenant. Our soldier friend said he saw Napoleon El Pequeño's private island. So you and me are going to take a boat from a dock in Siniestra to Cayo Villarreal. We take out this Singao and Jose's whole operation crumbles. But keep this between you and me, okay? Papa's got enough stress to deal with right now. See you at the boat. Yo, 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 look who's Let's back. Go, guerrilla. Show us what you got.
We are taking a lot of risks for one lieutenant. You want to complain? You can swim. Nice boat. Is it yours? No, I stole it. Papa taught me how to hotwire tractors when I was a kid. Boats aren't so different. Hey, we have to get Carlos a doctor. Hmm, good luck. He's coughing blood, he needs help. Papa took me fishing once, south of Costa del Mar. He's a hell of a rancher, but a shit fisherman. No patience, couldn't cast. Kept snagging his line on the bottom. Even hooked himself in the lift. <laughs> Got so pissed he threw a stick of dynamite in the water. Killed a lot of fish, but also put a fucking hole in our boat. We swam five kilometers back to shore. All these boats stopped to help, but Papa told them to fuck off. What does this have to do with Carlos being sick? I'm saying that the day Carlos Montero gets help, is the day hell freezes over, Tammy. Coño. You Monteros are stubborn. Not me. Just Papa. <laughs> sure. Sure. Shut up. Fucking tobacco. It was supposed to make our people rich. That's what Anton said anyway. See, si. That's how we got elected. Yes, and a lot of us voted for him. We believed in his promises. We thought it was going to be like the old days again. Like some kind of fantasy. We were so fucking wrong. If we want to change things, someone has to whip us all into shape. Bring us together. And it's not going to be Papa. Carlos doesn't have a plan. His plan is don't tell anybody what the fuck you're feeling, ever. Don't trust anybody either, especially your own daughter. Just fucking react to whatever Napoleon el Pequeño throws your way. He's old school. Reminds me of my headmaster in the orphanage. Strict, tough as shit, but if he liked you, he had your back for life. Hmm. That kind of thinking is gonna get us all killed. We can't keep reacting to Jose. It's not working. We need to try new things, be agile, stay one step ahead of that little hijo de puta until he's dead. I'm with you. Good answer, Danny. You smoking Mexican? Tobacco out here has been vivido. Can't even smoke our own anymore. Come mierdas. Shit. Que pas? Jose fucking Castillo. Anton's bitch of a nephew. Lo veo y no lo creo. What's he doing? He's, uh, he's... With the lieutenant we were looking for. Looks more like a scientist. Let's take Jose out. No. no. My hit the lieutenant. What's going on? Fuck. Hey. Over there. I need to know where that's... 